Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. Aries the Emperor here, back with another general reading for the Aries Collective 858 on the clock as we get started. If you are new here, welcome. This is an all Aries channel for all Aries placements. Cross watchers are welcome as well. Um, just take in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with everyone. So just simply take what does, leave what does not, place the gender roles where they need to be for you. This is energy and energy is all fluid, okay? So I just thought I would pop on here really quick and do a, what is it? We're gonna do a, what is being said about you Aries, every last word, okay? I feel like it's been a little minute since we've done one. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and, and do one of those readings, all right? So let's jump right on in. What's being said about you, every last word. Thank you to everyone who has liked and subscribed to the channel. Thank you for all of your donations um, to those who have book readings. I will be reaching out um, and I have sent some readings out already um, as well as if you'd like to uh, shop the candle shop. I'll leave all that info in the description box below. Thank you to those who have been joining um, my exclusive membership club. That info is in the description box below if you guys would like to join um, I will be posting today um, in that, in both rooms. Um, so just stay tuned here, okay? All right, let's jump right on in. Ooh, my throat chakra is already being affected here. Let's jump right on in, guys. All right, we have the Page of Wands and the King of Swords. So I feel like what's being said about you is um, you are someone that may have come from a humble background. Uh, maybe someone... Like I mentioned, that didn't come from much, but you've always had a, a big vision for yourself. Um, and you're somebody that never underestimated the power within you and how far you can go and what you can build as just one individual here. I feel like all you really needed is an opportunity um, and or a door to open up for you. And you're going to show up and show out even with the, the most least um, resources or I feel like somebody could have more resources than you and you still outshine them in some way, shape or form. And this makes people feel a way because it's like someone putting in a, a lot of work and going to school, you know, for a, a lot of years to become a, a professional or be certified in something. And you just come in here, you know, six months to a year or, of some sort here and you coming in with the same energy as this king here. Um, and you may not even be you know, the same age as this person, or it, it really doesn't matter as far as age or um, background, but I just feel like you're someone who is quick and on your toes and you don't let things slip through your fingers. And people realize that about you, um, that you're not really nothing to play with and um, you can't really judge a book by its cover. I feel like people kind of do that to you as well, right? Um, and that's why when you show up, you, you sit them on their ass. And, and that's really shocking because these are people who are well-to-do or, like I mentioned, supposedly on a different level than you or carry some type of title or just feel like they're higher or uh, just because um, I feel like as well here, you may not be someone who is really flashy um, and others are. You know, they kind of symbolize that as power. Um, when in actuality, you show up in the room and your your energy, your aura itself is the power here. Um, and I feel like that makes people feel a way and they want to feel that or they want to experience that or they want people to look at them in that light, two of cups energy. You know, they want people to want to fill their cups up and I feel like you do it and you do it effortlessly here. Even, you know, you're somebody who does your own thing any, anyways and I feel like that's noticed. So people kind of want to push more into your life or to kind of, I feel like they're more curious about what you have going on here, okay? We have the Six of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I would say people will say you're somebody who's really giving, but at the same time, you work hard for your money um, and you work hard as far as when it comes for coming through for your family, your friends and family. 
And I feel like you are someone people know that will give out. But at the same time, you want your fucking money back when it's time. You know, you're like, don't ask me for something. And you know, you're not going to be able to pay me back is what I also feel like people know about you. You know, it's balanced to this. I feel like people know you're going to give out some tough love if need be as well here. You're not going to pacify nobody. <laughs> I feel like that's people are saying that about you here, okay? Tower, like don't fuck with Aries, you know. Get on Aries' bad side uh, or collective's bad side, you know, here. Because that might be the last time you see him or her, all right? You know, collective, because you don't mind bringing a tower. And I'm not saying that as in you starting something, but you will finish it. I just mean that in general, like I just mentioned here, um, people always want to beg, borrow, and steal, um, and not knowing that that alone will mess up a relationship with you here. Um, and sometimes, I mean, that's just how it is. You know, I, people, you live and you learn, you know, you can't be out here playing with people's money, time, or energy. You know, it, it, this that type of shit is really limited these days here. And you take this type of stuff serious, especially your mental health. And you'll burn a bridge in a second here. For you, it's not burning a bridge. Hell, it's lighting a fire to keep you warm. And away from these heathens out here is what it's really doing. That's your protection. All right? Nine of Cups. Because you are, like I mentioned, you do your own thing. Nine of Cups is a singular energy that is successful um, and fruitful in the things that they put their hands on. In the lives of the people that they enter into. Um, you're just somebody who I feel like is amazing. And somebody here, people realize that you do really well. Like I mentioned, individually here, okay? Like you have the power of like 10 men in you of some sort here. Is what I feel like people would say about you. And this is masculine or feminine energy. It's like they people know you can run circles around them if you really wanted to get up and go the distance here like people i feel like are saying you have the stamina you have the wherewithal you know what i'm saying and, and you will bring you will bring the pain if need be you know what you stand for so you're not gonna fall for anything it took this person a long time to fill these nine cups up this shit didn't happen overnight People starting to realize, you know, you put a, a lot more work in than what meets the eye than what they see on the outside. And that's why I said in the beginning, people are now seeing about you. Do not judge a book by its cover. And damn sure not what you read on paper. Death card, Scorpio energy is what you don't see coming at the bottom of the deck. People see that you are deep, man. And there's levels to this shit. That they couldn't even begin to fathom. But you walk right through the fury. Right through the fire. That's what this tower death card energy is. And you come out on the other side. Stronger. Faster. Better than ever. Every time. You don't go down. And even if you do, it's only for a second. It's only to go down and bring you right back up. And I feel like people will notice that about you. You're not a quitter, Aries. You're a go-getter. That is what they're saying about you right now. Stand in your way. You might get burned. Oh. The devil mm, is not happy. Page of Cups. Neither are the breadcrumbers around you. Five of Pentacles. Did you cut somebody off, Aries? Because I was just speaking hypothetically, but yeah, I feel like you're really doing some real damage control here. Somebody's dirty laundry is not your problem anymore. And that's what's being said. That's what's being noticed. The tower is right on top of the five of pentacles, which is, yeah, I minted 
Once you cross that line, you got to stay there. I feel like that's what's being said about you. And guess what? They not happy about it. How dare you? How dare you choose yourself? How dare you not let me manipulate you, cheat on you, beat on you? How dare you? How dare you not take this little ass offer that I'm giving you in this immature, low vibrational ass energy? You know who I am. I'm the devil. And I came to collect. Not this time. Not this go round. Because like I mentioned, do you know how long it takes to fill these nine cups back up? This man is sitting. And I dare you to move him. That's what's being said about you, Aries. You will go up against anybody, including the devil himself. You might come back wearing his skin on your back. What's that saying? Throw me to the wolves and I'm going to come out that bitch wearing a fur. That's what they saying about you, Aries. Queen of Wands is what you don't see at the bottom of the deck. You right where you belong. And they scared. I can't make this shit up. I would be too. Cause you's a motherfucking light show. Give them hell, Aries. In the worst way. Okay? I'm gonna leave this reading here. <laughs> this is amazing energy, y'all. You know how powerful the magician and the tower is? You're so close to God. It don't make no sense. Who would dare come try and test you? Ten of Swords is what you don't see coming at the bottom of the deck. <laughs> For some reason, I feel like what's being said about you is why won't you come back and play? Play the game. Revisit the situation. Clarify the magician spirit. Queen of Pentacles, Two of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. What's being said about you is that you've paved the way. You are paving a way. You are being set up to pave a way. That's going to move shockwaves. And it's something that is long overdue for you. The time and energy that you've had to invest back in you is what people are seeing and noticing. How powerful you are. You know, all in the single presence, collective.
I'm going to leave this reading here. Hit that like and subscribe button for more messages. I'll catch you guys later, okay? Ciao.